Hi, this is Ilma Art Studios Photograph for today. A uh, beautiful landscape in, uh, that I took from the highway. <clears throat> Hi, this is Ilma from Ilma Art Studio. Check my website for more artworks and photographs at ilmaarts.com. <clears throat> today I'd like to share with you my poem devotional extracted from Hebrews 12 verse 8. It says, if God doesn't discipline you as he does all of his children, it means that you are illegitimate and are not really his children at all. That's from Hebrews 12, verse 8. Here's my poem. Discipline is a sign of God's love. Do you love and discipline your own children? Do you do it to protect and safeguard their well-being. God corrects his own people with love and tenderness. He loves us like his own and wants us to live in righteousness. If you get convicted by the Holy Spirit of God, he wants you to be victorious and rise above. Discipline is a sign that you belong to him. It guarantees all his promises to be redeemed. Here's my essay. It is a challenge to discipline children, but it uh, always brings out the best for them. If you have children or is taking care of a child, you know the importance of correction in their lives. If you do not correct a mistake, they will constantly do it until it hurts them badly. God is the same with us, like a parent or a caregiver. He wants the best for his children. He watches over them, ensuring that they are free from harm and danger. The Bible talks about the importance of being convicted and corrected by God. It is a good thing even though at the time of being disciplined, it feels like we are hurting us so much. It pays off in the end. Prayer. Lord, thank you for correcting me. Reflection. What was the hardest correction you got from God? Hmm. Uh, to answer that question as my insight, I think the hardest thing to follow is to let go of all my performances. Um, in other words, like I live my life coping with all my traumas and all my uh, hardships with performing, uh, always doing my best, always um, putting my foot first, the best foot forward, and making people uh, and seek approval. So that took a while for me to um, let go, but uh, once I radically obeyed God, it just flowed that uh, I wasn't into to approve to get approval anymore um, another thing that was hard to be corrected from is to take leadership um, where I am NOT supposed to take lead lead in especially like in my marriage it's supposed to be my husband to lead but if I see that no one is leading I will take take it and so I think that's a, a form of pride because you're assuming that uh, since nobody's doing it, that you can do it because you know it all. So these are the things that God has been correcting and disciplining me with. And also my thinking process. Sometimes I, I revert back to my old thinking negatively and worrying. So that's another way uh, that God has corrected me um, for him to trust him. So thanks for watching and I hope you check my website at ilmaarts.com for more artworks and photographs. Have a wonderful and blessed day.